Well done tonight, Jerry. Uh, a win on the board for the team and progression in the competition, which I guess was the aim. Yeah, obviously with these games you, you want to get through the group, so obviously not getting the result last time it was important to get the win. And yeah, we've done well to get the three points and we deserved it, I think. Yeah, dominant display all round, but uh, frustration, I guess, in, in the first half there were chances, you know, coming, going, not quite hitting the back of the net. What was the talk in the dressing room at half-time? I think it was just keep calm. Um, Kind of like we were creating the chances, it's just about being clinical when the, when they came. So, yeah, we were doing the right things. Second half, we were able to put the goals in, which we we deserve to be fair. So, I think yeah, in the end, it was the fair result. Yeah, I guess it was all about capping the display with some goals and and two for yourself. You must be pleased with that. Yeah, no, definitely. Obviously, I like to score goals on the forward. So yeah, it was nice to just obviously be back out there playing again and score goals is yeah, it's a bonus. Yeah, the second goal especially, absolutely brilliant here. Yeah, I bet you were pleased with that. Yeah, no, I'm pleased. I'm pleased. Like, it's nice to see it go in. Um, yeah, all the all the practicing that we do, it's just great to see it play off in the game. So yeah, I'm pleased. And I suppose in some ways the first goal was perhaps more important, obviously for the team in terms of getting, you know, a goal on the board and setting you on the the road to three points. But for you personally as well, it's been a long long road back from injury, so it's probably a lovely moment for you. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I think. In terms of the game, yeah, we obviously knew that getting that first goal was going to be important um, to, to kind of settle us in the game. And then, yeah, for myself, it's been a long, a long road, a long journey. But yeah, it makes it worth it being able to play again and score and win. Yeah, so it's been great. Yeah, and it's been a, a hugely long road back. I think it's 17, 18 months. But give us a, a flavour of what that's been like over the last sort of year, or year, year plus. Yeah, very tough. Um, yeah, I probably have to write a book to say all the things that have happened. Um, but yeah, I've just kind of had to work hard and get my head down and push through all the kind of setbacks that I've had. So yeah, just to be back out here now makes it all worth it, like I said. Yeah, so it's probably, oh, it is a long time ago now, but I think it was your, your, your time up at Doncaster towards the end of the season before last. What was it that happened? Yeah, so I had, I had an Achilles injury, um, kind of was misdiagnosed basically, and then... Um, my surgery basically the surgeon kind of messed up with my surgery so I had to have second surgery which put me out for a lot longer than I should have been should have only been out a few months but ended up obviously being longer because of mistreatment really so it, that probably makes it harder to take when you're out that long because of a lot of things out of your control you're trusting people to give you advice and if they get it wrong then obviously you're the one that's affected but yeah throughout it I've just kind of kept my head down um, pushed hard with my rehab and obviously progressed to this point obviously being back on the pitch and now playing again I'm just looking forward now and hopefully you know as the season gets on can can keep you know helping the team. Yeah, you, you mentioned a, you know a misdiagnosis along the way there were, yeah. there, were there any times throughout that, that that road back that you thought perhaps I'm not going to make it? Um, no I never let that that kind of get me down you know obviously there's times when it's tougher than other days days when it's tougher than others you know what I mean to keep to keep going but I always believed in, that, in myself and and you know if I kept working and doing the right things you know I'd get to this point step by step I'm, I'm obviously now here so yeah like I said I'm looking forward um, and use all the kind of frustration from that time to put it back on the pitch now. I suppose you, you have to stay so focused I mean it is such a long road back psychologically that must be a lot to deal with for you. Right? Yeah yeah a lot a lot it's, I think being injured I've never really had a long-term injury before this obviously so I think more mentally than anything it's the toughest part I had, I had a good support system my family and friends and yeah like I said I was always believing that I could get back and yeah I'm happy to be now back and hopefully have a, have a strong season here. Okay. Yeah. You'll be grateful of, of, of the chance here at, at Cambridge United as well. They're giving you the opportunity to get yourself fit and start playing football again. It's it's huge for you, I'd imagine. Yeah, no, 100%. I'm, I'm happy to be here and I'm I'm glad to be here. And, I'm, and I think I can help the team. So that's why um, I'm going, that's what I'm going to try to do this, this season. Like I said, I'm, I put everything behind me. I'm just focusing on helping the team this season. And yeah, it's a good start. And hopefully just there's more to come from me. Yeah, as well as this evening, obviously getting your goals as well. You, you you fitted in well. You're enjoying your time with the lads on the on the training ground and you know in and around the club. Yeah, no, it's been great to be fair. Just fitted in with the boys and just yeah, like it's it's like I've been here a while. Like you can see with the team, they've been together a long time. So yeah, it's, it, I've been welcomed really well and I feel I can feel myself getting fitter every day and every week. So yeah, as the season goes on, yeah, hopefully we can do good things. Cause there's a good good quality here. You know, I guess that's the aim for you, really, isn't it? To just stay fit, try and get yourself into the starting eleven on a regular basis. Tonight would have helped. 
no end. Yeah, exactly. We all we've got a strong squad, and we're all going to be needed throughout the season. So, yeah, we have to just stay ready. Um, and yeah, when we get opportunities, obviously make sure that we we do what's right and prepare well and play well. And yeah, that will obviously bode well for the team going forward.